what is going on man we back with another video man this is dan to dan as well man it's some new anime everybody been watching i never seen this but hey we got some beautiful ladies man go ahead introduce yourself let them know where they can find you at hey y'all i'm asia you can find me at my tiktok at highoff.asia and my instagram is under oh underrated dot asia one hey everyone my name is jalisa you can find me on youtube at jalisa's journal or on instagram at jalisa janine what's up y'all my name is lady day you can find me on tiktok at lady day beautifully outspoken underscore hi i'm nikki you can find me on tiktok at strawberries underscore blueberries underscore i'm jada y'all can find me on instagram at jada noel j-a-d-a-a-n-o-e-l-l -L, and on tiktok jada osam with two m yeah, yeah, oh, it's been a good minute since y'all got a short vid out of me, but this was a show I wanted to check out, so I might as well check it out with y'all. And it gives me a little break from the 40 minute vids. But yeah, I seen them trailers and it caught my eye. Now, first thing I gotta say is that opening is tough. <laughs> Victorious. <laughs> now first thing we see is homegirl arguing with her boyfriend now fellas you do not want to be like this guy this is what you call a bum asking Ooh. your girl for money to take her out is diabolical work Ooh, these are the type yeah, of guys who peak in high school have y'all ever had that before absolutely mm -hmm. no nope. a dude ask you out sprinkle he sprinkle for money to take you out with the money you gave him it's too many bums out here I'm telling you, easy to come by. She said that bum life, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Living that bum life, no count. <laughs> 10 years later, you're gonna try to get some Mickey D's when you see them at the cash register. <laughs> oh man, Kev, that's you. <laughs> Remember me, we went to the same school together. How's it been? We that's are not friends, ex. bro. Even back oh in school, we was at most <laughs> associates. They be trying to spark a full-blown convo like, bro, this is not what I came here for. The last thing I want to do at McDonald's is have a reunion. Just hand nice. me my nuggets, dude. But to make it even yeah. more weird, dude was like, oh, yeah, I can just take you to a love hotel. What? I can't even blame her. She was going straight for Bro, the juggler. That guy's a weirdo. But it was to no avail. She got dropped immediately. So she has the class and her friends are clowning her goofy ass. They told her not to date that bum, but she still did it anyway. And her excuse was that he looked like Ken Takakura, whoever that is. But yeah. now that that's out the way, the fuck is that? What is this monstrosity <laughs> on my screen? I'm not gonna lie, you gotta fight somebody. Your parents, siblings, shit, even your so-called friends right behind you. They just let you walk in the house like that with that yep. bullshit yep. on your face. Okay, Obviously, they don't care about you. And you got the supplies on your desk like you did a good job, bro. Throw that shit away. Makeup could be cool. Makeup, just you? make sure it's Why not you in your hands. Like also, that, on another note, is this how Japanese people see us? Because there's times when they get us right. They got better over the years but there's okay. times when they fully despise yeah. us oh yeah so she was walking the halls when she peeps these the kids banana? bullying this dude and how bad does the bullying gotta be for the entire class to segregate they refuse to sit next to bro and why are you throwing paper like you not sitting by yourself just like him they are not nice. gonna be friends with you bro you can cut it out and look at these badass kids Throwing papers already crazy, but putting a magnet in there is out of pocket. Where are the oh. teachers at? Anime mm -hmm. makes it seem like there's only three teachers in the entire school, bro. Help him. They getting creative now. Who just casually has a magnet in their pocket? They gonna start smuggling in contraband next week. But that's when homegirl <laughs> sits next to him and all of them got in line. But now she's back to waddling in the halls and I don't Why even know how bro like got it? here. Instant <laughs> transmission. But he goes full dwee mode talking about how Trump met up with aliens or something like that. Homegirl was like, yeah, I don't really care about UFOs and stuff. Um, actually, they're called UAPs, Unidentified Aerial Phenomena. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad she walked away because he she just like, kept bro, going. But her walking away must have not been a big enough hint. Huh? I don't care. Leave me alone, you dweeb. <laughs> the last thing I need hey, is your door gas shoving your weird <laughs> looks in my face. That's why you have no friends. You fucking loser. You should have uh -huh. left while you had a chance, my guy. But that guilt mm -hmm. immediately okay, kicked but she in. Just was getting you beat say up, something so. crazy, right. expecting them to mm -hmm. fire back, but they don't. Now you feel like a dickhead. Now you have to apologize. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. 
I don't believe aliens are real, but I believe ghosts are. You believe in ghosts at your grown age? You know, maybe he isn't that bad. I kind of like this guy. They was arguing about it and ugh, this angle was way worse. Looked like a damn skull trooper. So they made a deal that he has to go somewhere haunted and if he sees a ghost, he becomes her servant. And the same goes for her. If she sees an alien, she becomes his servant. So okay. it cussed her at the place and not gonna lie, I thought this was a group project. A Why are you here by yourself? They're talking to each other on the phone. It turns out bro was on a whole different yeah, map looking for though. ghosts. Huh? So you're both stupid. <laughs> Never watched a horror movie before? Oh yeah, she's doomed. Meanwhile, bro was tweaking out and yelling in a tunnel when Momo was like, oh, by the way, ghosts don't like loud noises. At least that's what they say online. Huh? Oh, so you're a fraud. I'm not a fraud. I told you, my grandma's a medium. She's the one who raised me. Both my parents are dead. Damn, okay. Uh, mm. I don't know why you felt the need to tell him that. Now, <laughs> of all times, there's of a time and a place and this was neither. She like, was that information had no benefit on the convo at all. If anything, you made it awkward. Because what else can you say to that besides sorry? But I guess that was supposed to lead into her backstory. So when she was younger, her grandma had her doing this ritual pose for good luck. Doesn't matter where she was at, where she was going, she was told to do the pose. But it got to the point where her classmates started making in front of her worst of all her little crush was in on it too and kids gonna oh, be kids nah. she told her grandma that she hates her and is never nah, doing that pose again that but she video, wasn't dude. really mad about her little crush not liking her back she was more mad that her little crush was making fun of her grandma and all that was to say that she believes in ghosts because she loves her grandma and she believes in what she does then she was like now it's your turn to tell me why you believe in aliens uh shit i don't know they kind of cool, so why not? <laughs> you know, I kind of like this. They're easy to talk to. We should do this more often. Oh, what? Damn, I must be tweeting. Oh, what, what is that? that? What the fuck is that? <laughs> Mama Odie? What? Man, I can already see the comments now. Hey, Kev, hear me out. No, keep your fetishes away from me. See, this guy got the right idea. Bad <laughs> ghost motives are kind of popular. Like, you don't want to kill me or anything? Take over my body, perhaps? Why is your goal to be a freak? But unfortunately, running was pointless. Got hit with a domain expansion. And at that point, he was doomed. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> What if that no. was her grandma? But they're in this together. Oh. If one gets caught, so does the other. Got ran up on by three Mr. Beans. And not oh, gonna lie. No. A lot of questionable activities is going on right now. She wakes up trapped in a chair, clothes what? torn, surrounded what? by these freaks demons talking about some. We oh, are really? a friendly species. Unfortunately, what we are all that? male, so we cannot reproduce normally. What is that? Bro, what, what? is going on? Look at his oh, face. That boy is ecstatic. Wow. Happiest is wild, he ever been. Though. And it's just getting freakier. What? They some real freaky frogs certified. But what, what is that? I, I might, I might gotta get them the award. You know, they might be worse than Diddy on this one. <laughs> yeah, they got their own little Diddy parties. For real, they got <laughs> underground tunnels. Dang, freakier. They start using do psychic abilities to force arousal. Huh? I, I, I don't, I don't, oh, I don't okay. even know what to say. What? They're what? pushing boundaries, but not quite hitting the line yet. Wait, what's their number? <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> the neck break sound. Your girl's busy. He did not let that slide. Took that shit to heart. <laughs> and climbing through a phone is cool as shit. Not even gonna lie. But the Dang. first thing he does. Huh? <laughs> uh -oh. what? Shit, I ain't know Diddy had influence on other planets. Shaboy <laughs> Jane munching as your primary oh, no. attack is wicked work. Oh, like on wild. one hand, a yo. You the had a lot of options there, but you choose to chomp on Shaboy Boing. But on the <laughs> other <laughs> hand, that might have been a big brain play. Huh? If you think about it, you can take a couple punches to the face and be all right. But once you get hit below the belt, you're finished. And even if you nice. do get back up, that's minus 30 to your strength, minus 45 on your speed, minus 58 to accuracy, minus 71 to intellect. Your armor broke. Health is on 1 HP. It's really a downhill battle from there. I'm just saying that might have been a good strategy. Would no. I do it? Fuck no. no. I'd rather fight Batman himself no than way. do that. My job was to recognize the game plan. I'm not the one on the court. Because look, it did work. <laughs> He's not getting up anytime soon. And Momo is a funny person. She sees bro, makes direct eye contact, sees his predicament, proceeds to say nothing along the lines of, oh, are you okay? 
Is that still you in there? She said, get me out of here now. And I respected every word. I'll check up on you when I'm safe. But then the Mr. Beans proceed to rip their skins off. And this episode must be Shaboing Boing theme because they cannot stop talking about it. Give us your banana. Kill me. So homeboy dodges all their attacks, hits them with a jump scare and ain't oh no way. God. The Shaboing Boing bandit strikes again. He literally had a free headshot, but still went for the jewels. That is oh insane. I really hope when he gets back in control, someone tells him about his nefarious acts. About to make a name for yourself <laughs> for the wrong reasons. So he goes for the next one, but gets shut down immediately. But that's when he had his main character moment. I don't care what you do to me. I never had any friends, and I thought if anyone would, it would be aliens. I called out to you for years, but you never showed up. I got bullied nonstop, and no one cared. <laughs> But Momo was the only one who stood up for me. I won't okay. let anyone hurt her. <laughs> Shut up, Goofy. <laughs> yeah, that's enough fighting for one day. But when one MC gets that power up, the other has to get one too. And is that a flashback I see? Yeah, I'll go ahead and say they won this fight. She just learned how to release her chi. And she couldn't connect that kick earlier, so she said, fuck it, why not let it fly? And for a split second there, I thought she pulled off a crazy feat. Was about to say she can probably box with Naruto in them. But turns out she just kicked nah. going to his own whip. Homeboy still tweaking out though. He trying to catch as many bodies as possible. But she ends up pushing the freak lady out of his body. And before leaving, I kid you not, she says she swipe or no swiped his shaboing boing. Huh? And as long as she has it, he will be cursed. If you want what? it back, pull up to the tunnel. Let's fight you tacky little bitch. <laughs> And that was word for word. I did not come up with that. And so much is going on. Now the UFO is about to crash into the building. I got no clue how they even got in there. And there's no point in questioning it. So now they're this in a weird wild. situation. First off, Momo lost her fit. She better hope grandma is asleep by the time she get back home. Right. But if she stops using her power on bro, then he's going to transform again. So his game plan was to give Momo his clothes while he goes on the most important what? mission of his life. The Shaboing Boing Retrieval Arc. Now, obviously, mm -hmm. she wasn't going to let him do that by himself. But this next line changed their whole dynamic. Sorry. I'm an awkward guy. Could you please put this on already? I'm worried I won't be able to think straight. Hey, if it works, it works. She likes the nerdy guys. But it was really because he happened to say one of Ken Takakura's lines. The same guy she was talking about earlier. I'm assuming he's an author and she reads his books or something like that. But to confirm, <laughs> she was like, I never got your name. What did you say it was again? I'm Ken. Ken Takakura. <laughs> oh yeah, he got it. Now off the first episode can't lie that was pretty cool the thing that sells for me is good characters i think i'ma like the interactions in the show also the art the art is a1 makes my eyes happy but the only problem i have is that we gotta wait a whole week for the next episode okay <laughs> dang what what y'all think about that episode i mean i have no over. idea what i just watched right no off the bat Editing A1. Chef's kiss. Oh my god. Amazing. Confusion. I, I just want to so know much. why everybody creeps on pearls. I know, right? You <laughs> know what I'm saying? I'm gonna watch it. <laughs> no words. I'm gonna watch and it. it. Confused though. If them aliens are still around, I wish I had her problem. <laughs> yeah. They might as well just name this Diddy Party. You know, at this point. Yeah. At this point, you know what I'm saying? Going wild. No cap, man. But hey, y'all hit the light, hit the sub, man. Follow these beautiful ladies. Thank y'all so much for coming out. We out. Gang.